Hey everyone, Cody here, and today I want to talk about this painting right here. I don't have a name for it. I'm trying to think of some cool modernish name. Uh, right now, the only thing that comes to mind is Big Bertha, but I don't know if I'm going to keep that name. But as you can see, giant uh, black, white, silver, and gold painting. And I have footage of me making the painting. However, my phone overheated, so you don't get to see the whole thing. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to switch over. You're going to see the close-up of the... You're going to see the close-up of the painting, so you can see it, and then we'll talk about it, and then I'll show you the footage that I have of me making it. So let's head over. So this is the final painting. Um, you can kind of see that it's got these little pockets of color. I'll get a little closer. And you can see just a little like wavy designs in it. I mean it ultimately turned out really cool. So in the footage you'll see basically how I made the painting but there's a couple things to know. First off I made it by dabbing the paint with a giant plastic trowel, um, pouring the paint on and dabbing it across the whole painting and that's how I made the painting. Now you're gonna see the first layer of it in the video before my camera shut off so you'll see the process however it's actually two layers deep because I made the first layer, I didn't like it, and I made another one on top of that. Um, it's just the phone shut off, so I didn't record that part. Second, I learned that if you don't use enough paint, it doesn't create the little swirl look. But it's kind of a double-edged sword, because if you only use a little bit of paint, then it doesn't, then it starts to not mix the colors at all, and it just puts it on top of itself. But if you use too much, it makes the little swirls, but then it can also like bleed. Like the colors will, you know, literally run together. So you kind of have to be careful on how much you use, but you've got to use a decent amount to really cover that whole area uh, when you do it. So that's pretty much it. Uh, hopefully you enjoy this video. I'm going to switch over and you can see that. And I don't think there will really be any more talking. I'll probably just put music over it because I've already explained it. You can see it for yourself. See you over there.